Make sure you guys are in the chat for who you think is going to win. Get your bets in. Cheer them on. And the fight begins. Quasi opening up with a quick Axel. Oh, a huge heavy overhead lands for Quasi. Very early in the fight. He goes for a toe drag. It does not go around the parry, but an excellent try from Quasi. Countering very well here. And uh, to be clarified, we are on first to seven at this point now. These rounds are going to be first to seven, gentlemen and ladies. All right. Here we Bungie go. Quasi. Bungie v. Quasi. Quasi landed a big heavy overhead in the first part of the round. Is Heavy Mace the new Messer? Yeah, I think it is. I've been seeing this constantly. It's the meta weapon. I've been seeing it very, very often. Well, Quasi's been on the Heavy Mace for a long time. I think he was it's before true. the curve. The beginning. I mean, there's always it's always been a strongly represented weapon, but I feel like, yeah, that, that stamina change just makes it. Yeah, yeah after the buff for options. Blunt, it, it, it's even better. Yeah. Trading counters here. Nobody wants to give an opening. Quasi especially not. He's keeping the tempo of the fight quite well. Bungie is retorting a little bit. The rhythm is coming in his uh, his direction. Blocks a jab. Oh, uh, great disarm from Bungie. But he whiffs. No punish, no punish at all. I think the jump wow. on the punish was necessary. He should have just excelled. Yeah. Wow. How did he block that? That was a great canceled attack in the block there. Oh, and he jabs him. Wow. That's going to be the first round for Quasi here in the winner's finals. Yeah, I think that's an indicator that Quasi knows Bungie's waiting for, like, in neutral, he's waiting for Quasi to just start it to go into the defensive sort of posturing. But that was a beautiful jump, I think. More risks like that will pay off. Quasi looking confident. Keeping the pace. Oh, that a, but a, a giant, giant heavy axle or sorry, heavy uh, drag horizontal there for Bungie. Oh, but Quasi retorts. Big, big heavies here being traded. Somebody's low on stamina. Quasi's low on stamina. Wow. Yeah, it all he takes is two hits in this matchup. That's the thing. He, he correctly jabs and collides, saves his life. He's quite low. You can see him circling, looking for, Went for the job, some positioning. Yeah, he went for it again. Oh, he got hit with it this time. But he did get a little bit of health back, actually. You can see he got a little bit of health back. He wasn't jab health anymore. That is a really long laugh emo. I did not know that went for long. For that long. <laughs> Bungie, not chasing him down when I, he seems like he's low on stamina. Man, Quasi is just reading everything right now, though. Killbungie.exe has been activated. Great, Axel. See, he knows when to throw in the gambles. He knows. He has a very good mind about when he can take a risk and be safe, like right there again. Man, I mean, he is incredible with that. Like, he almost he knows, never gets punished for these. That's what is that? Wow, yeah, let's switch them all. That's... I, I wouldn't recommend that, but Bungie, I mean, he's on another level. We'll see if it pays off. Here comes the mall, yeah. Oh, he whiffs! Twice! Man, but he knows. He knows the mix-up, and, and then he gets a drag, a neutral drag there. I guess he's hoping he can get an extra hit out of being Vanguard, but it's like, not really. Kicks him in the butt there. A little tap on the ass. Oh, he whiffs, but still is able to block. Quasi whiffing uh, at least three times this fight. Yeah, I don't Quasi know what the punished. best whiff punish option is on the mall, but I, I guess it would be the overhead. No, I guess it would be an XL. Oh, he slash. kicks and gets it. Oh, he misses the the punish, though. Yep, the Bungie's fast enough on that to get away. 
Wow. Oh, my God. What an excellent counter Axel there. He misses the stab. They both do. Oh, nice jab from Bungie. Only damage he's landed at this point. Somebody's low on stamina. Quasi is. The ball is just are. so much worse in neutral than heavy mace. It's just... Yeah, that's not a contest there in speed. It's very tough to use. Oh, he tries he to go for the, for the cop, jump and then does not land it. He gets caught. Yeah, big time. Big time caught there. Quasi low on stamina still. Keeping his distance. Oh, he hits the barricade. Disarms Bungie. And that's it. And that's it. Wow. From being constantly out of stamina the entire fight to being the one who gets who, who disarms the other guy. Is he a V6 with this or not? I don't know what else you play to counter that, you know what I mean? Maybe a war club, but it's not in Bungie's wheelhouse, really. I don't think so, yeah. Honestly, Heavy Mace is something I rarely see him on, too, which is probably part of this where Quasi has many more hours on it than Bungie, I imagine. He's been playing this for quite a while. Before this, it was two-handed hammer, and he's very used to these little weapons. He's very familiar with them. When everybody was on Messer Knight meta, he was already on the next. Like it's I mean, it's been yeah, that way forever. Anytime I've seen Quasi play anything, it's he's what? But, yeah, this is a little bit of a slugfest with those overheads, but I know. Yeah, I mean, wow. I for sure thought Quasi was gonna end that combo right there, but he ended up getting a um, getting punished. Oh man, that jab is devastating. I think Bungie's already probably at that health level, if not pretty close to it. Um, he's got maybe two jabs in him. It's maybe 20 health, 25. I can't tell. Yeah, I think he's probably at 20, 25. I think you're right. Maybe I'm not an option here. No, but he goes for it. He keeps going for it because honestly, it's it's like a chip, you know. What it's I mean? like you love chip damage, and it just keeps the pressure on him. Even if it doesn't do the damage, you know, yeah, it's going to keep him thinking about <laughs> it. Yeah, big overhead from Quasi, keeping a very dominant grasp on this fight. Sun God suggesting he go Warhammer. I don't think Bungie would do that ever. Bungie, one of those guys that only plays one-hander when he's truly memeing. Yeah, when he truly, truly has no other option. <laughs> I don't really ever see him play one-handed. He might be the most, the most outspoken of all the one-handed haters. <laughs> yeah. Anyway. That would be his Joker moment, I think. Trading counters here. Nobody's really finding purchase. Quasi is a little bit hurt from a previous attack, but isn't really faced. He lands one himself. Right back and it's even. Almost gets that overhead. I'm surprised Bungie was able to read that. That was incredibly difficult. Goes for some stabs here. Uh, the counters and who's not, because that's really what it's going to come down to here. Is... They're not taking a whole lot of risks, but Quasi's just playing a little bit more consistent. Consistency is the name of his game. He's very, very consistent when he needs to be. But it's not a weakness for him. He's not hes not predictable, which I think is uh, probably one of his greatest strengths. Because we're going to see something funky here, which is going to gain him a hit. No jabs yet this round. There it is, Axel. He isn't doing anything crazy. He's really just playing yeah. fundamentals well, and he's landing gotta, axles. You hit that like minute, minute and a half mark for this round and it's just like you're starting to get fatigued. That's what it comes down to. Is Some fatigue coming in from Bungie. Oh. We're not seeing much, many counters he missed, here. He missed that counter on the heavy. It's like normally, you know, if it's, that's the first attack, you'll counter that every time. But minute yeah. and a half in, you're, you're like... Bungie with a jab. Nobody wanting to give an inch here. One one a strike here can be the difference, wow. and there it is. Misread input. Bungie goes down. Uh, Bungie. Is that right? Oh, no, I'm sorry. Well, Pova said fine. Oh, is it first to seven? It's first to seven. It's first to seven. Oh, we're my bad. My bad. I apologize. You I forgot you were not here for that point. Yes, we are at first to seven at this point uh, from now on. So we've got some more rounds here. Quasi's going to need to take two more. And Bungie with the switch to greatsword. I am okay with this because I think it's more of his comfort zone. And at yeah. this point, this is, is less about any kind of weapon matchup advantages and more about who's playing better. Yeah, that's true. Fundamental chivalry, just hitting the counters, playing consistent defense, not getting disarmed. 
You'll notice ne neutral game is pretty much out of the question with these guys. They'll, they'll maybe Big axe. get a hit or two on the first one, but... That's what I'm talking about with Quasi with these nice little sneaky initiative steals. He's so good at doing that. He knows when he can throw it. Yeah, Bungie's not much of a gambler, especially with this weapon, you know? I mean, a successful initiative steal kind of gamble can really turn the tide of a fight if you're looking for an opening. Oh, huge overhead. Quasi's hurt. Toe drag or I think yeah, it was a toe drag, 100%. Nice. He's getting jabbed. Oh, wow. and Quasi goes down for the first time in this set. 5-1 in favor of Quasi. Really, there is an extent where it, your opponent has to make some degree of error for you to land a hit at this level. It's like... People just play so consistently, they don't miss. You know, like if we can count the number of whiffs in this match so far on what? One hand, maybe. And they're, they're oh, really just the big. Yeah, Bungie missed the input there and got a nice mace to the face. Yeah, I'm guessing if Quasi gets another hit here, it's going to be an Excel now, but we'll, I could be wrong. We'll see. Yeah, we're probably going to see a three hit kill here. I don't think he's going for another heavy. Oh, he gets gambled. Or maybe he misses his input, I can't tell. The neutral oh. player results in half quasi. Someone's half. Can't tell. Ooh, a successful oh, kick and a big nice kick. overhead punish, and it's even. Big. They're both backing off, Walter stand back. He's taking his time. Oh, another kick, but it. Oh, interesting there. I thought somebody was going to go for an axle, but Quasi thought better of it. He's low enough health. He doesn't want to risk it. Funny, we have to get this far into the match for the players to start using kicks. Yeah. <laughs> like, all right, we're out of mix-ups here. We need something. Just goes back to what we said before. It's a, it's a good option when you use it at the right time. Yeah, when, you, yeah, when, you, when it's like used that. sparingly against Quasi, I find that Quasi will get hit with kicks and he will actually get stunned by them. Um, oh, nice, nice. Yeah, there it is. There? He did. <laughs> it was a close fight. Quasi was quite low, but it was not enough to win. And he's got a monumental task ahead of him if he wants to take this set. No, he still probably will need to fight him again. In right. uh, yeah, grand finals, how it goes with, with Sheepy, and that'll be a match to see. I mean, Sheepy's been so top today, for sure. Yeah. Grid drags here from Bungie without the heavies. I think I like those quite a bit. He misses another jab. Nice. Oh, big drag from Bungie. Another, Another Axel combo coming in hot here. That's going to bring Quasi down to just under half health. Should one good... still need two hits. It would be one heavy overhead, I think. One heavy overhead will do it. Yeah. Oh, another Axel. Or actually a nice little neutral drag there with the horizontal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He just seems more confident to just take matters into his own hand. Oh, and there's a nice little initiative steal from Bungie. We've seen crazier things. It is currently 6-2 in favor of Quasi here. Trading counters, nobody's giving an inch so far. 
Nice jab here from Quasi, mixing it up. He nice rushes pop. him down, goes for another one. Whoa, yeah, that was weird. Tempo it looks like, you know, Quasi seems to have a bit more of an offensive mind here. And it oh, gets it's around his parry though. Yeah, he got some good footwork there. Yeah, oh. Wow. The oh, wow. Whip. Oh, wow. Wow, wow. wow that was good.